Hey guys, Jimmy Vegas here, and a couple of months ago I did a short video on something called Unity Visual Search by a company called Resini. And since then I have had quite a few people ask me the same sort of question about using paid assets in their scene. And how can we actually see them? Well, I don't think I properly covered it when I originally did the video, and I actually find this tool very very useful. Now, just to kind of put this out there as well, I have not been paid for this part. This is nothing here. This is all off my own back because I felt there was a way of showing you guys a little bit more to this tool. Now, if you go to the Asset Store and search for Unity Visual Search, you'll find them right here. Resini, it's a free add-on, plugin, whatever you want to call it. And you'll have it over here. And let's find something that would be paid for. So I went ahead and searched for lantern. So we'll have like a lantern hanging down from here. And let's use this one. So let's say we found whatever we're looking for. We could just drag and drop that into our scene. And there we go. We can actually manipulate it as well as we probably could with any item, really. And we can see just how well it works with our scene. So you can see here that. I've clicked on something else here, but it still exists as its own item, and we can actually click it. And you'll notice above it, it does say the word preview. So if you want to look for assets and you think you found something, but you don't know if it'll work quite so well in your scene, you can actually go ahead and use that visual search to actually find what you need and then put it into position, like there, for example. So I have that lantern hanging there, and I'll put one the other side as well. So I'll duplicate it. And I will bring it over here and let's have it about there. And now let's have a look what that looks like in my scene. So there we go. We can see those two lanterns hanging there. And keep in mind, they are actually paid assets. I have paid assets in my scene for free. Now, you have to keep in mind that to actually have the proper asset, you would have to buy it. But you can see this over here. We can click and show in store and it will show us where that lantern actually is in the store. Now, what I like most about this is you can do this with almost anything. In fact, you probably can do it with anything. Let's take this lantern, for example, and just bring it into the scene, place it there. A bit small, but again, it's something that we can work with. And if we actually click on it here, and then we can see its actual price is this. No problem. So we could find, I don't know, a boat. So let's go with this one, Old Boat 2. And you can see it's not the best of quality. Of course, you wouldn't expect it to be because this is just a preview of how it would look in your scene. And we can see how it does look in the scene. And if you feel like, yeah, actually, the high quality model of that will be pretty good, we could always go to the store and get it right there. So keep in mind, tax will be added onto some of this because, you know, tax reasons, it may say 89 here, but it's a dollar in the store. Don't forget taxes and everything, wherever you are in the world, also does make a difference. So once again, that is just a dollar, but we can see it in our scene for free. So we can try out different things and you can do it with free ones if you want. You can do it with anything you find in the store, quite literally anything. Just drag and drop whatever you find into your scene to see a preview. You can also see that. In the game view as well. Now this tool um, recently got updated I think um, a couple of days ago actually so you know they're always updating this they're always adding new things to it but again you can see just that preview sign above it you can't really leave it in there obviously it wouldn't look very professional but honestly guys it is a fantastic way of finding whatever assets you would like to use in your game trying them out before you buy it's a great fantastic way of try before you buy and I would recommend this. So guys that's how you can preview paid assets in your scene for free. If you want to know any more about this please leave a comment below and yeah guys I will see you around. Thank you very much for watching.